this is anything with tech, especially with things that are coming up around the world and mm -hmm. anything with tech right now. You know, there's so many deep fakes. This is fake. This is fake. Everything's you can you can make anything look like anything at this point with Photoshop. And this is how to use your phone to spot fake images. Uh, this can be used for anything. Insert anything here. Just spot fake images. Um, some good tips in here. Like, for example, just look at the picture. Um, for example, when was the photo taken? Uh, what time of year are there people? They use the example of it's 35 degrees in Iran now and if people are in long sleeve shirts or short sleeve shirts they wouldn't be in short sleeve shirts um, where was the picture taken like figure out where from which direction like who would actually be taking the photo could you actually take a photo from that particular angle uh, inconsistent lighting so you can tell there's a manipulation there. You might have a shadow on one side of a person's face and then the opposite side of another person's face and you're like that's not right and then it gives you tools that you can use um, Google reverse image search is great for this um, there's something I've never heard of, Tinai, uh, works similar to Google uh, Reverse Image. And then uh, it's a great to determine whether a photo is actually from today or from 10 years ago. Because a lot of times people will pass around mm -hmm. photos and articles from 10 years ago like they're brand new. And you're like, holy crap, this just happened. I just new. had one where uh, uh, my sister and some other people had shared one about uh, five planets are lining up. They haven't done it in a decade. <laughs> and then I looked at the, at, at the article and I'm just like, and I, I hate to be that person yeah. and be like, Hey guys, this article is from three years ago. Yeah. <laughs> so we see it a lot with celebrity deaths too. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so and so just died. And you're like, no, sorry. They... It was like, yeah, it was a while ago. Yeah. yeah but did. but but when people share things, mostly they're not clicking through and reading the article, no. or the article is so bad on a phone that you can't find the actual information mm -hmm. that you're just like, oh hey, look, tonight this is happening and I'm seeing reading it now, therefore. It's real and yes. now. It's <laughs> so. happening right now. And yeah, it's and a lot of times they make it hard to find dates on things on purpose. So you have trouble figuring out whether or not this is a new article or not. But it's just uh doing some due diligence, especially with everything going on. And also the big thing is humility, which people do not possess in especially in the social media world. You're not perfect. We've all shared articles that have been old or photos that have been doctored accidentally and yeah. without oh, doing our research. Just, yeah. oh, screwed up, admit it, move on. Like, don't, <laughs> I am a thousand percent correct because this aligns with my views. You're like, not necessarily. Mm -hmm. but, and especially today, since there is a lot going on, I know I'm seeing even notifications as we're sitting here about what's going on on the other side of the world. Like, mm -hmm. I mean, this is, this is the kind of, you know, uh, misinformation that, you know, we've been talking about since you know, the last big election. Right? Yeah. So kind of that. And there's only so much you're going to be able to do. I mean, I have plenty of relatives still sending me very, very strange things. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I've honestly, I've snoozed a lot of people on Facebook. Which, That's a big thing. That could be a good, awesome thing of the week is if you did not know that you can snooze people for 30 days on Facebook. Uh, I use it a lot. Yeah. If you don't know if you're ready to quite unfriend them yet and you just need to snooze them and see if that improves your life. <laughs> yes. Yes. It helps your mental health mm -hmm. a lot. You'd be like, you know what? This guy's going through a thing right now. Maybe I don't need to see it right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. Maybe in 30 days, it's all passed and we'll be better. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes so. it does, and then sometimes you just got to unfriend some folks. There, but then if you realize, oh, no, I think I've snoozed this guy like three times. <laughs> Maybe I need to let them. Maybe we need to come to terms on this on Facebook. Okay. 